over there. I was walking my dog Kimbo when it happened. It got really cold. And it was hot out. And I mean, really cold. I just stopped. There was nothing there but there was something there. I don't know. But I didn't want to walk anymore. I didn't want to do anything. I just wanted to stand there. I can't describe it. All desire to be human just disappeared. Everyone says they felt empty. And I guess that's right. Empty like a husk. It's not like being sad. Sad is something. There is nothing. And there was definitely this feeling that someone was there that I couldn't see that did this to me. I stood there for a while like that, just standing there. And then Kimbo started yanking on the leash and kind of led me back home. And then at home, he just kept coming up, wanting attention. And I had no reason to pet him or touch him or even look at him. And he just kept nudging me. So I finally looked at him and I'm looking at this dog that depends on me for everything. For food and walks and love. And I knew that I would never be able to give any of that stuff to him again. Because you have to feel love or whatever to keep this other living thing alive. So I grabbed a knife and stabbed him until he was dead. It's hard to say. Caring. Caring about things. I only have my memories of emotions. Memories fade. I left him there on the kitchen floor for a long time. Days. I just didn't care. But then the smell, I just 
physically couldn't tolerate it any longer. He was bloated and the blood had glued him to the tiles. I started to cut him apart and put the pieces into plastic bags. It took hours. I had to just do something with this chunk of rotting meat. I tossed the bags into a dumpster and then started to scrub the dried blood and shit that had been left behind. Once that was done, it was just about taking care of the other stuff. We leave behind so much crap when we die. Pets are no different. There were toys, feeding bowls, food. There was no reason for any of it. So it got tossed along with the body. Yes. Yes. If I didn't talk about it, then I wouldn't be able to keep the memories. 